Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a look at the Dexter Trailer Axle Beam with Easy Lube Spindles. Now our axle is going to be a very important component of our suspension system. It's going to replace either an existing axle on our trailer or help us to fabricate a new system for our trailer application. So this is going to be a pretty heavy duty axle beam. It is rated for 7,000 pounds max capacity. And this has a total length of 95 inches measuring from hub face to hub face. Now the hubs don't come with this, so you will have to purchase them separately, but you can find those here at eTrailer.com, as well as the other components to get this installed, including the electric brakes, bearings, races, seals, and all that good stuff. Now, this is going to have a high steel construction. You might notice that there's a little bit of a bend in that beam. That's to help give us a zero camber, so that basically means that there's no tilt in and out for our wheels. So it's just going to give us a straight line acceleration, and that also helps our tires to wear evenly all the way across the width of that tire. At the ends here, you'll see we'll have our five bolt flange for our brakes to mount up to, and it comes with these little caps on either end to keep the spindle relatively lubricated and rust free in transit. It does come with the D washer, the nut, and the keeper on the end to keep everything in place. And then you'll notice that grease zerk on the end. So that's our easy lube spindle there. It makes it a lot easier to do the maintenance on our trailer axle. So we can just pop on our grease gun, pump it up full of grease to top it off. And that makes it easier than having to pull the whole thing apart and pack those bearings or pull the whole cap off to get grease inside. Now, whenever you do install this and you have those bearings, initially you want to pack the bearings full of grease by hand because that's the best way to ensure that you're getting grease into all of those little nooks and crannies so that everything is greased up properly. But whenever it comes to just doing that regular maintenance, that grease zerk on the end is the way to go. Put this back on there. Now the spring seats are going to be an underslung design, so that means that our trailer leaf springs are going to be mounted to the bottom of the axle. So that helps to drop everything down and give us a little lower deck height than normal. The advantage with that, if you think of our trailer as maybe being up here normally, whenever we have our ramps come off of there, they're at a higher angle, so they're going to be a little bit steeper. If we drop that trailer down, now our ramps move out, and they're at a more gradual or gentle angle, so it makes it easier to roll things up onto that trailer than whenever it's a little bit higher in the air. So that's the advantage with having it drop down a little bit lower. The spring seats, brake flanges, and the spindles are all welded on. It does have the five-year warranty. It is a limited warranty as far as the other specs with this. Again, 7,000 pound weight capacity. The hub to face to hub face measurement is 95 inches. If you measure from the spring seats to the, to the center of each one, to the same spot on the other side that gives us a measurement of 80 inches. The tubing diameter is 3 inches. The bearings that you'll need for this, which again sold separately, inner bearing you'll need part number 25580. For the outer bearing you'll need 14125A. The brake flan configuration again, is a 5 bolt configuration there. This is made in the USA. And that's going to do it for our look at the Dexter Trailer Axle Beam with Easy Lube Spindles. Again, you can find all the other accessories to complete your suspension system on your trailer right here at eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.